Welcome to the demo for the Clover Station. For a full-service restaurant, we can take orders through the Register app. The Register app is simple to use for to-go orders, walk-ins, pickups, or call-ins. The whole menu is laid out into categories. Click on a category and it will bring you to the items. Click on an appetizer, select buffalo wings. You can choose a size and a sauce with modifiers that you set up in the back end. There's a print option to print the receipt. We can print a sales receipt or send it to a kitchen printer. To pay, simply press pay button. You can swipe a card or enter a chip card or enter a cash payment as exact amount or quick pay option. The change due will be shown. There are multiple receipt options available as well. Cash drawer will pop and the sale is complete. You can also order on the tables app. You can open a table, add items, enter an entree, choose modifiers, and click done. You can add or subtract number of guests and can split the payments between the tables or payment type. To pay, press pay button. You can swipe a card or enter a chip card or enter a cash payment as exact amount or quick pay option. There are multiple receipt options available as well. The inventory tab is where you can make changes to the menu. Clover can enter your existing menu, but since changes happen in the restaurant business, you can add new items, specials, price changes on your own through this app. You can import the changes with a spreadsheet on the clover.com dashboard where you can update all the changes and then import, or you can make changes one by one through this app. Just click Add Item to add a new item, enter the name, the price, and cost, and any associated modifiers. You can also update quantities. Just click on the quantity and update the number. Click Save, and you can see the new quantity is reflected. The Shifts app is where employees can clock in and out. You can run server reports and declare tips. To clock in, simply hit the clock in icon, then click clock in. You can see the employee is now in at what time and for how long. And clocking out is just as easy. The reporting app shows all sales from 12 a.m. last night to 11.59 p.m. today. You can also adjust this based on your business. All sales are listed in the payments breakdown. You can also view items report, discounts report, and tax reporting where you can set up and keep track of multiple tax rates. And you can even access these reports on your phone or computer. The employees app is where you go to add new employees, set the roles and permissions, and this is all customizable on the front end or back end. Simply click the green icon with the plus sign to add a new employee. Then you can enter their info. You can also check the roles and permissions that employees have on the register. The Discounts app is where you can create custom discounts with percentages or set amounts. To create a new discount, click the green icon with the plus sign. Add the name of the discount and if the discount is a percentage or a dollar amount. Click Save and now you can see the new discount has been created. To view all orders, you can use the Orders app. These are all of the orders within the business, such as Open, Paid, and Partials. You can view times, amounts, statuses, and seating. You can search for an order and also close out the day. The Gift Card app is where you can sell, check the balance, reload, or issue store credit as well as cash out. Clover charges $1.25 per card. You start with 100 cards. Clover charges 2% of the card amount. So a $100 gift card would end up being $102. Thank you for watching this demo of the Clover